Do not neglect to visit here often. So this is just going to pad the game out, isn't it? Hmm. They would never do such a thing. The way I look at it, we have two things we need to do. One, I need to be your baby brother and live in that cot. <laughs> two, <laughs> go get me a bottle. Start stripping. Uh, by the way, speaking of padding, huh? we should be at least level five oh before my. we call her. One! <laughs> so, we, call her. we should go grind. Okay, simple enough. Go grind and then give Villa a call. No! Fuck you! Don't acknowledge it don't like mix. that! Are we even cool enough to hang out with someone like her? <laughs> No. I don't think anyone no. else is cool as her. Growing, and you're an overgrown man-child who can barely pick up a record. So let's head out of Frankton and try to find some things to beat up. <laughs> Sounds good. Maybe for two to three hours. Some... I'm gonna freak Wait, in. Wait, the phone! What? 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 <laughs> just trying to see if you figured it out. I would love to just come out and say it, but I think it would scare you. That you're writing the script on the spot? Yes, I figured it out. Nope. I haven't figured no. anything out. You should at least tell me your name. Think back to when you met me. We were kids. I think losing my religion by how I am had just become a big hit. I went over to your house and we listened to it on your stereo for hours. My mom came to pick me up in your house, heard the song, and freaked out. I can not remember. She that. held her head and said, What the hell is going on? <laughs> the story was so specific. It's almost it as if it so was a story he was telling me. I couldn't place it. It was like I had read it in a book somewhere. Why don't you just say, it feels it familiar, been on the radio? but I'm still not sure. It could have been in a book, a comic book? Well, Chris, what's your opinion? Is this dialogue so flowery because you're supposed to think he's pretentious? Or is the writer just... It, it comes off I mean, like he just... the problem is that other characters do it. It's not just him. No, yeah, it comes off like he's trying to make everything sound as smarmy and like intelligent as possible. If it just applied to Alex, yes, that's deliberate. But the no, fact it that is that everybody. It's everyone. It is no, everybody. I think it's an the accident. The thing that Vela said. She went in a fucking circle where too. she talked. To, no, she didn't explain what he what she meant no. by metaphysics. She just defined all these related terms that have nothing to do with the discussion. <laughs> and then he went, "Whoa, you're like powerful and smart. <laughs> I love you. Can you define more words at me? What do you think references is? No. Oh. 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 The story of Yeek has directly used excerpts from or paid homages to the following pieces of media. Please, <laughs> please do not sue. <laughs> I, I am the Ab Gab Gab Golab. I forgot about that. <laughs> the Scribble Gabble Gubble Labble Libby Labble Flab. I well, like. go and start a Flash Collab. <laughs> <laughs> Get ready oh, to yeah, grind. We gotta grind. Uh, me, 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 me. Welcome to the grinding episode, you guys. I'm scared. Shut up. Mm. Fuck you. <laughs> I am the big, big ginger golib. <laughs> I, I wish. It, I on. wish the song was like ten minutes and more family members started coming <laughs> in. <laughs> The flap a boop a lap. That would have been really good. <laughs> hey, he's such a delightful character. There needs to be more of him. Ooh, what's down here? That's a monster den. Level two? Yeah. Oh, it's four grinding. Mm hmm. Look out for this guy. He looks like a real motherfucker. Uh. I hope he doesn't fuck my mother. Because that is what a motherfucker would do. By definition. Stay away from my motherfucker. <laughs> You can look up the definition in the dictionary and it says guy who fucks Chris's mom. I am the 3-3 three, three rat q lab. It's <laughs> okay, Chris. That wasn't even funny. <laughs> it's okay! <laughs> just roll with it. Uh-oh. All that loading, just for three rats. God, I'm good at this game. It's just really <laughs> so amazing. Are you looking forward to seeing so what happens? stupidly good that I think it's really badly... Look at that. Oh. Oh. He got love the way he goes. Ah! <laughs> now, do you know what rats are weak against? Stomps. Cat. Electricity. All good choices. Rats are actually pretty oh. frail, so I imagine they're weak to a lot. Like what? Rain type. Rat is a rain You type? could probably drown a rat. Spring type. You could probably turn a rat into a spring. That's like a variant of a rat king. What? A spring? Yeah, they, all, spring. All, they all get stuck together and form a spring. Is that girl not gonna join our party? Uh, no, cause you're can you want to convince her to, right? Yeah. Oh. By being strong enough. Cause I she assume. is really fucking cool. I agree. Whoa. That was a complete accident. 
You're never going to impress her. Dodge! <laughs> Dodge! I like the sound design. Yeah. I like I, the little noises. I, I think the soundtrack has some The little clips that the songs. enemies have. Mm, the voice acting's a tough one to tackle. <laughs> Why do you say such things? I think Vela's okay. Yeah, she does it well enough. Alex's mom sounded fine, voice acting wise. We got to hear his mom, I don't remember that. Yeah, at the beginning, remember? On the note that she left for you. What did she say, Ding Dong? She baked you a cake. You want to talk about all the Princess Peach content we were watching? Uh, yeah, you start. How would you how would you describe it? Yeah, how would you describe how, it? Uh, I'm not sure. They were all horny. They uh, were. We were- we were- how did we even end up on it? I typed Chris in Mario. Just, That's it. Chris put on like a Mario he parody. He was auto-playing just like yeah. Mario-related videos <laughs> off of YouTube. And then what, it was Daisy and Peach? And they were getting increasingly horny. Yeah. There's one where Peach and Daisy are making out, uh... There's one where... Where Peach finds Peach crying in the woods, but it's actually... Bowsette. Bowsette. She, find, she finds yes, Bowsette crying. And it's live action! It's like on a... You, Chris was the one that pointed out like how weird the setting was. That it, yeah, like, they're on like a weird like mansion. And it was in a different language. Yeah. And Mario was mad because the two were falling in love with each other before his very eyes. And they wouldn't fuck him. And he it says, very, Mama Mia, please stop doing that. It felt very fetishy. It was cool. Probably because they were kissing and, and he, making out. And he beats her to death with a with a question mark block. <laughs> YouTube gets pretty freaky when you're not paying attention. Remember when the uh, weird Treasure Planet one auto played? Yeah. Somebody animated their own scenes. I know we've talked of about Treasure it before. Planet. Yeah. But yeah, they, they it looked really accurate. Lots of animated movies like edited together to like ship. Uh, characters. Tarzan's Jane and uh, Jane and the the Treasure the, Planet. <laughs> Lady. Cat lady, yeah. And then the villain from uh, Osmosis Jones. I forgot about that one. Remember, they all explode from a dynamite blast and then they're ghosts on a <laughs> beach together. You're thinking of Kingdom Hearts. It feels about the <laughs> yeah, same. Yeah, it's like the same thing. Chris, you've seen those, right? Which one? I'm like, sure we showed it to What's the one? This was years and years ago. What's the That's one where I they get like... cancer and they have the shaved head? That's right! It's uh, Prince Eric from uh, The Little Mermaid. You've seen that one, right, Chris? Oh, oh! You'll be my spouse. Mm-hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I love that video. That's one of my favorite YouTube videos. Prince Eric has a big bald head and he screams and he has no eyebrows. It's fucking scary. <laughs> <laughs> Chris, you've been using fucking scary to describe like everything. That is scary. When 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 he what? That's the big reveal of the video. Yeah, the just whole like vi just like Jimmy. That's a good like punchline to the video. Because the, the whole thing is absurd. <laughs> that he's going like, to die. You're like, very, no, I agree with you. When that when he comes out with his bald head, you like you, it, it, you everyone lose in your the shit. room always shrieks in laughter. It's the funniest thing. What's your theory on who made those? It just feels like either some did a teenager get really ridiculously good at editing footage? I mean, some footage? people also kind of like fetishize drama. Or is it like that they high that they that this is like a forty year old person who does commissions? Of, like, people's... It was actually the original animation studio. They all got back together and made those. And maybe. I feel like that's that's the problem, is the one that we Damn, originally dude. remembered. I feel like there was original animation there was. in it. There was. And that's what made it stand out. And they were matching out. the style pretty decently. Because most of the animations are just, they're cobbling together existing footage. Because it was them, you know, but like, I remember hugging it. and everything. And we had to look up and be like, wait, what? This isn't that's from the movie, the movie, obviously. Yeah. No, people put, like, crazy amounts of effort into those. It's really bizarre. Uh, but... Everyone's got a hobby. Yeah. I'm at a point where it's really just like, I, I'm happy people are just making things and putting it out there, even if it's really bizarre. Oh, well, obviously. Uh, oh, that's what I was going to ask. Chris, uh, do you have any hobbies that you would say are that, like, ridiculous? Uh, I don't think so. Really what about don't. your mustard taste testing channel? <laughs> I'm actually trying to think. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Did you just think, oh, you just brain farted me so hard. Chris, you gave me that was overload. a joke. You actually don't have a mustard taste <laughs> testing channel. Dude, they're gonna kill me! You use I know. Oh, no. dodge! You gotta dodge! Damn it! Ah! I'm dead. Ah, oh, he is. Fuck. Where, how far does he have to go back? Game over. Uh, I'm not sure. <laughs> yes, please. Good for you. Thank you. <laughs> well, I know now that I'm kind of shit. 
You're not good enough for yeek, Chris. This wasn't the original Game Over screen. What was it? Remember, he go, You have died. Oh, it, it starts you off like this? Okay, well then I guess you're fine. That's not bad. Oh, you can't touch me. I'm Alex from yeek. <laughs> I am beyond reproach. There we go. That's what he sounds like. <laughs> Panda? Panda is good. Panda protects you completely. Oh, completely? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So what do you do? It's also like one of the only skills that has an animation like that. Huh. I kind of wish more of them were more dynamic looking. Let's try this guy's skill. Photo shoot? Oh, it's all. It's all. Okay. So I just go... Yeah. <laughs> Why did it only do one? What? I'm never doing that again. Oh, oh they gave him a health meter now. But originally, he didn't have a health meter, yeah. so you could just keep doing it over and over and over again, never get hurt. I guess that's... he, he yeah. realized he had to balance it. I think he picked up on that. I like the panda. He doesn't like you. Why not? Because <laughs> you're living at home. Oh no, he's gone. Oh. That's just not, abruptly. He had enough. Yeah, that was kind of weird, he just vanishes. Does that bother you in games immensely when there's not even like a the particle oh, yeah, effect? Yeah, because yeah, it's really easy to add a particle effect. Or something, like have them sink into the I mean, you can even just like deform the model. There's ways of doing it. Or just shake it and shrink it or something. Yeah, exactly. Fading you can just away. shrink it. Yeah. Shrink it down to zero. Aw. Ow. That hurts. I'm a big boy playing big people games. This is a mature game for adults. This game is strictly for strictly adults. Strictly for adults. That's a, that is what I was thinking of. I didn't want to quote it directly. Does it actually say that? No. <laughs> yeah, giant red text appears at the beginning. This game is strictly for adults. I assume it's rated for adults, but... Uh, A.O.? We're referencing uh, Parappa 2, right? Is that the one? Yeah, that was Danger Tech. Guys, I'm getting good at Yik! Yeah, Finally, you did I it. can enter that tournament. Did you beat the game? The big yik tournament's coming up. <laughs> Cheese? Yes, please. You rhymed. <laughs> I'm very fucking smart, you know. Give me anything and I'll rhyme it. Uh, Harold. Harold, huh? Yeah. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Harold. You could say Carol. He are old. He <laughs> are old. Oh, come on, dude. Seven, really? <laughs> <laughs> 23. <laughs> that was not perfect, even. Making me count when clearly I can't. Oh my god, this is gonna take like seven days. <laughs> <laughs> seven days and seven nights. <laughs> Kill him, little guy. It's a Bible story. Oh my god. What's your favorite Bible story, Chris? The old man and the wench. <laughs> tell me, tell me, I'm unfamiliar with this. The once was an old man. Particular verse. Walking down a dusty road, he happened upon an old wench. Who declared, I, the old wench, quench for the squench. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Which meant, in biblical terms, she wanted a kiss. Mm. <laughs> so what's the moral? Mm. <laughs> the moral is, he bent in, but as he bent in... That's not a that's moral. Not a moral. <laughs> that's just a thing that happened. As he bent in, an evil tax collector dropped a pencil down his ass crack. <laughs> Like in his pants. <laughs> he started crying. <laughs> and the Literally. tears washed away the earth, the dusty earth, uh -huh. and out came the scorpion. <laughs> I see. Who stabbed him in the webbing of his toes. <laughs> and he lost all of his feet. <laughs> and he, he became known as the first leper. I see. Now. They are, they do mention lepers a lot. They do. Yep. And I don't think this is the context for it, though. <laughs> what are you talking about? That's a good story. Yeah. But what's the moral? Don't trust anybody. You gotta be <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. No! He couldn't trust you. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> I'm imagining at the end of the story in all caps, it just says, Don't trust anybody. <laughs> don't trust anybody! <laughs> That's so biblical. Matthew 65, 4. Oh, fuck, dude, I'm gonna run. This is too scary. It's on the bottom of, uh, um, in and out cups. <laughs> I forgot they do that. Fuck, dude. Jeez, that was scary. Whoop. 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 Ah! Fuck! I'm dead. What do these things represent? Lust. Power. <laughs> Diamond rings.
democracy. Things. Let me out. Let me out. Damn it. Let me out. That's not fair. Yeah, that's fair. not fair. Fuck you, Yik. And the creator of Yik specifically. I'm coming to get you now. No, I'm not. I'm sorry. That's the, the character in the game is. <laughs> that's where he's going to. I hate these bouncing dudes. They're just bullshit. You're not. Oh, there's one. Oh, what the fuck are you? Oh, I does was, that count? That was not. Like, it, that's never fair. It's so stupid. I never want to play Yik again after that. <laughs> it, it did sour your experience. A little bit. I am a big, beautiful boy. Well, maybe it's time to level up. Okay. Come over here and say it in my mouth. Salah. <laughs> 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 -la. Let me in here. Damn it. You want to talk about Wizard So So? Oh my god. Yeah, what'd you think of Wizard So So? There's a. Guys, there's a movie on. Amazon Prime. It's free on Amazon Prime. Oh, Wizard So So. It's it, it it had me hooked from like minute five. It's fun. It's it a, is so it good. <laughs> He's a really entertaining character. There's this wizard with a high pitched like shit voice who befriends a cat, and the cat gets bullied by three giant rats, and the wizard and the cat decide to battle the rats by using magic to inflate the rats. And what, you have to inject their right butt cheek. Yeah, there's a lot of ass cheek talk for some reason. Then the second story, there's a dragonfly <laughs> that wants to be a dragon, yeah, and then he turns them into a dragon, but then they're evil, so he turns them back, he but says, then he turns them into a dragon again. Yeah, it's oh, yeah, so that's how funny. It that, you know, he turns a dragonfly into a dragon because it asks politely, and he's like, okay, I'll turn you into a dragon. And then the dragon just goes, Hmm, now that I'm a dragon, I want to eat you! And he goes, Ah, that's mean. And then, and then, and then, and then he's like, Fuck you! And he, and he turns it back into a dragonfly. And he goes, I'm sorry, I let me be a dragon again. He goes, Okay, just promise not to do that again. And then he turns it back, and it's like, I'm gonna eat you! And he's like, Ah! And he, he turns it back again, and he goes, I don't like hanging around with you. <laughs> he says something he's like, like he specifically says like he says something so he goes mean like, oh, and real. I don't, I don't want to be. What does he say? You're I don't want to be around you anymore. It the, sounds like he's a valley girl or something. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's the most brutally honest, mean, but like <laughs> true thing you would say. I don't want you to be around me anymore. All right, he sounds really upset. It's like really messed up. He's a clumsy oaf. He's always you're dropping gonna be, things. You're going to be put off by the animation, but it's worth sticking around. It's you're also going to be put off by the 10 minute rat concert. But oh, that yeah. is true. We got bored. If you sit through the rat concert, it gets gold. Trust us. You do get an achievement for it. <laughs> An achievement. It got a 100%. <laughs> we were saying so -so. it should just be a, like a PS2 game. It would have been a yeah, classic. Yeah, because all the backdrops are pre rendered. Yeah. Yeah, it's like Resident Evil at parts where he's like climbing up the ladder to escape, like like in Resident <laughs> Evil Four. When he runs from the giant boulder, this is the mind. Goes, this is. Yeah, I had to get out of here. <laughs> he does do that. Speak. What is what is that thing? That's a new thing. That brain. This is how you level up. That's how you level up your friend. So I can just keep talking. Yeah, to this? I I don't know when it stops you, but yeah, I just keep oh, doing. I it, assume I guess. just when you're out of experience. Yeah. Damn, I had quite a bit, didn't I? Well, there you go. He's level five. Whoa. Now you have to go in that door where the bird is flying downwards. Am I already done? Yep. Yeah, I guess so. What's this? That's brain Yalon. Brain in a vat. You want to change the way your mind works? Oh, uh, uh, no, whoa. that's okay. Reduce monologues. I don't want that. <laughs> I love monologues. Yeah. Original edit. Fuck you. Uh, what the hell are you? It's him. He's back. He's on a branch that's not there. <laughs> I am the funniest crow, remember? I'm the comic relief! <laughs> remember from the intro? It's like a Disney character. I was very funny, remember? I anyway... You know <laughs> Shut up and get out! <laughs> <laughs> Chris, no! Your dialogue's better. <laughs> <laughs> I am very proud of who I am. <laughs> Get the fuck out of my way! Okay. <laughs> I don't know what he's talking about. I wonder why. Let's go in here. Oh. MG. Yeah, how do you work this? Uh, you choose a door, and the number at the top is how many stat points you can put into a stat. 